Yo, what's happening everybody? Welcome back to Pimp My PC. Now this is the show we try to teach you how to personalize, customize, trick out your PC, but above all make it cool. Now today we're talking about some more of those desktop pimps. You curious yet? Step into my office. All right, so check this out. Look at my awesome desktop. Oh wait, you can't because it's covered with icons. That's lame. So what I'm gonna do is show you a couple of different ways to make sure you can organize your desktop. Pretty easy peasy, pretty quick. Now the first one's a DIY, and the second one's more of that lazy Lucas, can someone do it, uh, do it for me. First, we're going to start off with uh, the little more complicated one. So what you're going to want to do to organize this desktop is open up your terminal window. And if you don't have your terminal in your dock like I do, just go to your spotlight, type in terminal, and that'll bring it up for you. But uh, just for ease of use, I've got mine here already. And also for ease of use, I've already copied the, uh, the command that you're going to need. My man Maddie's going to flash that up for us so you don't have to listen to me spout it off. And I'm just going to or uh, paste this in here right now. So there it is. Like I said, you guys are going to see what this is. I know it looks like I'm doing magic right now, but it's all going to make sense when you see the notes. So we got the command in, going to hit enter, and then we're going to kill all finder. And it's case sensitive, so make sure you capitalize that F. We're going to hit enter, and uh, boom, there you go. See, look, my icons are gone, and check it out. There's my clone troopers on my desktop. You can see those guys in all their glory. Now, if you're kind of curious as to where that content went, which I'm sure you are, no worries, guys. Open up a finder and go to your desktop, and boom, all those icons that you just, uh, that you just made hidden, are all there for you to select, so no worries there. So now if you want to do the opposite, and I have no idea why you would, I would, but we'll get to that in a second. We're going to open our terminal back up again, and uh, basically just do the opposite of what we did. So rather, you'll see false at the end of this command, so what we're going to do is pop in a true, hit enter, going to kill that finder again, and boom, there's those nasty icons are back. So that's the DIY do-it-yourself. But you know me by now, it's Lucas, lazy Lucas as my man Maddie calls me. So uh, can't someone else do it for me? And they have. And that brings us to some free software called Camouflage. Now where you're gonna grab that is at a website called bricksoftware.com. Bit of an unfortunate name, but don't let it fool you. The software works perfectly. So this is where you're gonna grab Camouflage. And like I said before, it's free, which makes it even sweeter. So that's where you're gonna grab it. And uh, I'm just going to launch it for you right now. And you'll see that it runs just up here in my menu bar, just right up here. So what we're going to do is just click on it, and you can see the button right there, Hide Icons. Boom, and they're gone. Again, there's that beautiful desktop. Now, it's a little bit different to get, this, to, get to your icons this way, so if you're wondering where the, uh, where the content went, double-click that desktop. It opens up a Finder window, and all that content is right there for you. Now, just like the DIY method, Camouflage allows you to get that content and those icons right back on your desktop with little to no effort. I'm going to show you that right now. So we'll close that out, go back up to Camouflage, click on Show Icons, and boom, there it is, a messy desktop again. I don't want to go out like that. So we're going to hide those again. And uh, there you go, guys. There you go, two really easy methods. One uh, DIY, one uh, somebody else doing it for you, a way to go from a cluttered desktop to a pimp desktop showing off those clone troopers. One to two minutes, you can't beat that with a bat. Well, that's today's show, guys. Make sure you check out the show notes at butterscotch.com. And uh, remember, pimping ain't easy, but registering that next domain name with hover.com is. Just check out that promo code at the bottom of the screen and use it the next time you register your domain name. I'm Lucas. You guys keep it unique. See ya!